3D Muscle Journey, IFPA Pro Bodybuilder, here with Jeff Albers, my teammate, my good friend, also IFPA Pro Bodybuilder. Going to do a posing session today. Very, very important for presentation on Bodybuilding Day, and uh, we're going to go ahead and do all of the symmetry poses today. So I'm going to get in a pose, and then I'm going to let Jeff take it away. So, all, right. all right, first pose. First pose, I'm going to do front relax. So right here we can see we want to get a little more quad sweep. So we're going to have Brad just bend his knees a little bit more, a little more sweep. Good. At this point we're showing good symmetry. His chest is up, showing a lot of symmetry with size, keeping the shoulders square. There's one key thing we want to do just to make the pose a little bit more polished. We're going to have Brad rotate his hand this way. And that's just going to clean the pose and show a little bit more symmetry between both hands. So right there, uh, you're showing good quad sweep. Shoulders are nice and square, tapering down to the waist. That's pretty much uh, Brad's ideal pose for him right there. So we're going to have Brad move into the left side symmetry. So quarter turn to the right. Okay, so what we're looking at here, Brad's front foot is forward. And that's allowing him to get more hamstring. And uh, his shoulders are nice and square, tapering down to his waist. So we want to focus on the waistline, making the shoulders as square as possible. And uh, one key thing on the back arm, if we have him turn his elbow out just slightly, rotate the hand this way, you're going to get a little bit more width to him by drawing the elbow out. So that's going to contrast more to the waistline. It's going to create more of a, a taper. And that is pretty much Brad's ideal position. So we're going to turn him quarter turn to the right for the rear relaxed. Okay. So what we're going to have to do is Brad have him bend the knees just slightly. And what that's going to do is give him a little bit more sweep to the quads. And then from this point, we're going to have him arc back just a little bit more, create more depth in the lower back, a lot more taper now, V taper. And actually a little more knee brain, Brad. Good. And right there, we're seeing we're getting quad sweep now with the knee bend. His glutes are nice and tight. It's creating more separation in the glutes and hamstrings, creating more quad sweep. And with the, the lower back arc, we're creating depth in the lower back and we're creating a nice taper here. And that's pretty much Brad's ideal position. So we're going to have him go quarter turn to the right. Again, we're going front foot forward. And the reason we do that is to make sure the back knee is going to jam into the hamstring to create more separation in the hamstring and quad. Okay, it looks pretty good. What we're going to have Brad do is just twist slightly more, and that's going to draw this shoulder out more. It's going to create more taper by giving a nice twist. And that looks pretty good. One more thing, we're just going to have Brad point the wrist down. It's going to create more of a straight line, just a little bit more polish to the pose. And that looks perfect on Brad. So that's, our, that's his ideal position. And just to go ahead and relax, Brad. <laughs> and just to make a note, everybody's structure is different. So these little key things that we've done with Brad work for his physique. It may not work for everybody's, but it's very individual as far as posing, so not everybody's the same. So that's, that's one thing to keep in mind. Jeff, thank you so much, my friend. You're welcome. So Brad and Jeff, 3dmusclejourney.com, online training, bodybuilding prep. And uh, until next time, Brad Loomis, Jeff Alberts, 3dmusclejourney.com. Thanks, guys.